Hey guys, I tried to do a live. Hey guys, I was trying to do a live video, but my signal was too weak in here and that wasn't working. So I just quickly wanted to show you guys what I'm uh, cooking today. What you see in front of you is just a quick stir fry. This is what I do on um, lazy days. Sometimes I'll even have half of this already chopped. I use vegetables I already had in the fridge. I have a zucchini I needed to use up. And um, you can come in. Um, and then red bell peppers and um, maitake, hen of the wood, mushrooms, um, red onions. And then this is what the package looks like for the maitake. This is my favorite mushroom, also called hen of the woods. Uh, and I can kind of see why. Just a really good flavor. Even if you don't like mushrooms, you might like those. I used to hate mushrooms. If you told me six months ago I was going to be eating them this much, I would have said you were a lie. But let me show you the highlight here. And that is this broth right here. My mother said she wasn't feeling well, so I decided to make her this mineral rich, um, kind of like a udon soup. So in there, there's the buckwheat noodles. Uh, tastes just like regular noodles. Uh, edamame. And then this right here is um, seaweed. Very high in minerals. Really, really good for you. Um, if you've ever had sushi, you've had seaweed. It, that doesn't have a strong flavor in here, really. It just kind of tastes salty. Um, so I hope she likes it. This whole container is hers to enjoy. The broth itself is just um, a lot of my sea moss gel uh, with a little bit of Bragg's liquid aminos. I like to leave the Bragg's alone because I try not to do soy, including this edamame in here. I just need to find, I guess, a better substitute. So if anybody has any suggestions beyond chickpeas for the edamame, I'd appreciate it. And the coconut aminos, to me, does not taste the same. It's um, very sweet on the sweet side. So that, to me anyway, that doesn't work. So, But anyway, I just wanted to show you guys what I was making and uh, what's in the kitchen tonight. All right, bye.